Hi, this is Ram from ramkedem.com. In this quick video, we are going to learn how to join more than two tables. In the previous lesson, we saw how we can join the customers and packages tables based on the common column PackID. Now, let's suppose we want to add a third table, sectors. The sectors table describes the sector of each internet package. There are internet packages we are offering only to the private sector, and there are internet packages we are offering only to the business sector. For example, we can see that package ID 20 has the sector ID 500, which describes the private sector, and package ID 60 has the sector ID 600, which describes the business sector. As you can see, the common column in this case is the sector ID. So we want to join the sectors table in order to display the sector name alongside each customer details. Let's start by joining the customers and internet packages tables. Let's type select from on from customers. Let's provide the customers table the alias cast join packages pack on cast dot pack id equals to pack dot pack id and let's display the customer id the customer first name and customer last name and the package speed Now, in order to add the third table, sectors, all we need is to add the following statement. We say, join sectors sec on sec dot sector id equals to pack dot sector id. As we already saw, this is the common column. Let's also add the sector name at the select clause. Let's execute. And as you can see, we are getting the expected results. So in order to add a third table, we need to add another join statement, which indicates that table. And then we need to add another on statement in order to specify the connection between this table and the tables we already joined. When you join data of different tables, always remember to use table aliases and keep in mind that the join on statement is some kind of an expansion to the from clause, meaning that after we are done with joining the tables, we are still able to add clauses such as where, go by, having, or order by. For example, we can say we want to see only business customers, so we add the where clause, where sec dot sector name equals to business we can sort the result by the customer id or we can say we want to see how many customers we have in each sector so we can say select sec dot sector name count star for the number of records and then we can say group by sec dot sector name we can also sort the results in ascending order by the number of records so we say order by count star so in this quick lesson we learned how to join more than two tables in the next videos, we are going to learn the concept of outer and self-join. Please feel free to ask any question you may have in the comments section below. And if you are looking for a way to practice what we have just learned, in ramkedem.com you will find hundreds of exercises on many different levels. More details can be found in the video description. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.